make sure to their temples of production? Uh, first of all, I want to say that uh, Minister of Home Affairs, Stephen Campion, is actually a very, very wrong person to even warn our president, Haka in the Hichilema, over violence and even in linking him to the Hachemples, a case that was in court and was closed by the court. Now we realize that actually there seem to be efforts of trying to get to our present Haka in the Hichilema. And we know where these efforts are coming from. The country at large today is aware of statements made by the PF that President Hichilema will never be on the ballot. That is number one. Number two, there was even a statement that was mentioned in Livingstone that Etonga will rule, but certainly not HH. And that statement was also issued in Pemba that there will never be a Etonga president. Now, that has been an agenda. And now, because we're going towards elections, time is going. All efforts to link HH, all efforts to find a case against President Jaka in the Hichilema have failed completely. And now that is why today we are seeing cases, private cases, where now we are seeing government officials having keen interest on private cases, linking our president Haka in the Hichilema, all in a bid to find a case. Honorable Stephen Campiongo, let me just remind you, you are aware that in 2016, President Edgar Lung appointed a commission of inquiry on electoral violence and vote pattern. The report was released and there were names that were mentioned. I'm addressing Honorable Campion. Names were mentioned. To date, we have never seen any action. Some of the people that were mentioned in that report are still serving and continuing to exhibit their violent behavior. Honorable Campiongo, you need to sober up as a Minister of Home Affairs. Look at your ministry. Look at your ministry. The callers on a radio station yesterday even said you are it is disappointing that the wall of a minister can lie about the attack that happened in Kawata. that is not supposed to come out because of the ministry that you are managing honorable campion you are so busy and very agitated you can even see the tone on on on, on this issue of trying to link link hh an issue that has to do with 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 with, with, with the private property. Yet, Honorable Campion, you have been quiet. Three months before elections, to judge, we have not seen a report that can inform the Zambian people who was behind the ritual killings. To judge, Honorable Campion, you are only remaining with three months in office. We have not seen a report on who was behind the burning of the markets. Honorable Campion, to date, again, we have not seen a report on who was involved in gassing. Those are the issues that are supposed to, 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 to agitate you. Why? Because they affect the general populace. They do affect the citizens of Zambia. But you are quiet. How many things have your candidates done, Honorable Campion? And you have been quiet. You have not been agitated. Let me remind you. When Mao Sapa was running his, his political party in Dola, right at the apron there, we had a fleet of cadres right on the apron, acting in a terror system. What did you say? Nothing. What happened in Sesheke? We saw the PF cadres armed with those weapons. What happened, Donald Trump? Did you come out? No. We saw the retiring of Wakunguma, national interest. 
Policemen are now being beaten. They were beaten at the police station there. Policemen were beaten. Did you say anything? Nothing. Cadres are able, are able to enter in a, in, in a media house, in a studio, to try to attack, just because they've heard the voice of HH, just the voice. Wangena Kumuchinga, almost attacking a poor journalist. What have you said, Honorable Kampiongo? Nothing. Even in Kamwiri, the one who is, who is working with you now, was also attacked at the studio. What has been said? Nothing. Now, it's like Honorable Kampiongo, these things which affect the general populace do not affect you at all. Now, let me ask you a question. Why are you why are you so much agitated about this issue? Where you're even warning that if President HH is involved in this issue of the or in this in this issue of the Kaloma farm, then you try to catch up with him. Why? Why the journey? Now that is the one that actually is giving us a hint that you are trying to get at HH. Now let me tell you. We have experience. I know uh, Commissioner Kanganja said, Inspector General Kanganja said that, you know, it is not true that we want you to arrest the HH. Honorable Kanganja, we have got to not trust. Anything can happen under this government. Anybody can be arrested under this government, whether they've committed, whether they've committed an offense or not. The example, the good example I can give you is, you kept our president, Hakainde Hichilema, for 127 days in prison. You humiliated him. You were moving him from 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 the from the prison there near the court. You take him to you take him to to, uh, to Lilai. From there again you move him. He's in Kawe. No he has been brought. Hundred and twenty seven days. We saw you you marshaled the policemen who were always on duty when we had a court case. Allowances were paid. What happened to that case? Let me also remind you. An officer, whom I will not mention the name, pleaded with the court that I lied. I lied on oath. I did not investigate the matter. But he was arrested. So, Inspector General Kanganja, you should understand why we cannot trust you. And we know that HH can be, can, anything can happen to HH now. But I think what I have to say is that Honorable Kampiongo, you are a wrong person actually to deal with this issue. Deal with the issues. You are only remaining with three months. Let's say those reports come out. And by the way, you are supposed to draw a line between your ministry and police. Allow them to be professional. Allow them to act independently, please. Stop issuing statements that are supposed to be issued by the police. We do not want police to be politicized. We are aware that the police are working under so much pressure. We saw what happened in Kawata there. Honorable Campion, what were you telling the people on Hot FM? That you know, a UPND cadres were fighting on their own. That was a lie. You were told that. It is not supposed to be like that. A minister of woman is supposed to be very sober because of how sensitive the ministry is. By the way, when you are Minister of Home Affairs, you are not Minister of PF Home Affairs. No, you are a Minister of this country. We want peace. We need security. Those are the things we want you to look at. Not every time, 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 every time. You go to these reports you are waiting for. Leave HH alone. HH has an agenda. He has an agenda to rebuild and to reunite this country. And he's doing that. And it is not the HH who is saying I'm going to be president. No. It is the people of Zambia that have chosen HH as their best choice because he has shown his commitment. He has shown his loyalty. He has sacrificed for this country. He has shown people that he means well. He has shown people that he does not want to become president because he wants to serve himself. No. It is because he wants to save the people of Zambia. That is why he says, my vision is to make life better. He wants to make it easy for people of Zambia to put food on the table. Do you know that people are not eating, including some of your members and some of the youths? They're not eating. But you have a But you have food. Look at your ministry again. Recently, we were discussing about we were, we were discussing on gun culture. 
to date, have you have we, have we, have, we, have, we, have we been told on why there's an increase of guns around we around among our youths? Nothing. Look at the behavior of your youths. Kuyendele mwana wabanti mo mo office. What is giving your youths energy and authority to go in? What is it? And then you want to say no? Eh, the PS must be fired. Ayopa PS was on to send chita ayopa. Naka pokoranzi ba gechi na ayopa. Who is responsible? It is you, as Minister of Home Affairs. It is you, as Chairperson of Security. So can we check responsibility? We love you as Minister of Home Affairs, but can you do what is right? Not only for PF, but for the whole country. That is what we expect from you. But hands of HH, the youth have told you, hands of HH, the 127 should have told you a last one. But this time, no, 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 no. There will be no youth, eh? there will be no woman. All of us will stand to protect our president. We do not use guns. We shall not fight, but we shall make sure that we protect him. Because the people of Zambia, come 2021. Niko why? Kuya baby. Van Tuba, Bakonda Neko Munyu, but not every time at the Tacha with Malaya Asila, Emarasha Asila. You send the children to market, but the child comes with no change. You want to say no, but Bandarama, because things are, things are, 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 are expensive. No, 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 no. Makangi, and to a Vuchika Makangi, there's nothing that you can do. I know the elections have awakened you, but in town we are in that. People know who you are. So hands off HH.